Welcome. Today we have a Patreon request for Epica, Cry for the Moon. All right, let's talk. More rock. <laughs> Expecting the chant up a I wonder how many voices are involved in that. I counted at least four females, plus the lead vocalist, so five. And then you have the male vocals in the background. There's four there, plus the lead. There's at least one male, but there's different. Okay. There's at least three males too. Such a cool rhythm. So I noticed this is 17 years ago. Uh, and the, the person that requested this, <clears throat> excuse me, the person that requested this did mention that this is the song that got them, uh, into Epka. Now the screaming slash growling 
definitely needs some work. <laughs> it's a, a very beginning form of screaming. Very pushed, very uh, not as raspy, not as powerful as it probably is now, right? Uh, I don't know how long Epica has been around since they recorded this. Um, I just know that it, this video specifically was recorded 17 years ago. So they could have been a band for 10 years before that, 15 years before that, five years, two years, one year. I don't know. What I do know is that the screaming definitely needs some, some work. See, at first I thought she was harmonizing with a violin of some sort, but when it panned over and cut to the backup singers, then I realized that she's harmonizing with them. Really cool. But the way that the, the string instruments went into that, it kind of sounds like it leads that harmony in. Really cool. This would be really cool to see live and just everyone chanting it, man. That'd be awesome. It doesn't seem like the drummer's hitting very hard. Like barely tapping it. keyboard though. an actual live recording? I wonder because she has the pop filter on there. 
makes me wonder if it was all if they got a bunch of overhead mics obviously all the backup singers are all singing in mics i don't think it's just for looks this may be the studio recording if you know let me know You know, they probably recorded a couple times, but... Really cool. So that was this requester's... Um, intro song into Epica. Uh, actually, I don't know if it was their intro song, but it was the song that like hooked them onto the band. Really cool. I can imagine, you know, back in the day, if that's the band that, or that's the song that got you into them and then where they are now, like that's a huge step, you know, really cool. Thanks for taking me back. That was awesome. I truly appreciate it. Let me know what to check out next. And again, stay cheesy, my friends.